Hello and welcome back to Stellaris. We're going to do our usual thing with this. I'm going to start the episode, I'm going to get it running, and then we're going to jump to whenever something interesting happens, which could be a long time from now. You never know. Um, basically, there shouldn't be that many years left in the game. There should be around 13 years, and then the end game will happen. However, each year takes a lot of in-game time and real-world time, so we'll see exactly when that ends up being. I don't know what events we're likely to run into. There is always the chance that somebody randomly declares war on somebody else and then something happens from that, but yeah, I'm going to let it run and I might meet you at, uh, you know, the big event happening, but we'll see. Anyway, letting it run. Right, so something has happened. It took four years and a half, roughly, but we are in a war. It is not the end war, but it is a war. It is the Vran Unity being attacked by the Quenti Watchers. Now, how does the Vran Unity even have a way to be attacked by the Quenti Watchers? I am not entirely sure. They're all over here and the Watchers are here, but anyway doesn't matter. They got attacked and therefore we are in the war because we are part of their federation. So, uh, it's time to go and beat these guys up again. So let's head down here and do it. Now one of our fleets is slightly out of position because there were some pirates which weren't really worth worrying about, but the rest of them should pretty much be over um, here. So I'm just gonna say, hey, fleets, uh, it's time to go. So is that the closest place I can go to? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty close. Um, what if I wanted to go here? Oh, that's better. Yeah, do that. Right, and now we wait for them to go. But yeah, there's not been an awful lot going on. We've had some resources reaching max. They, they tried to declare war on uh, the Quenti... Oh, no, not on the Quenti Watchers, on the... Uh, What's it? The Flavli the uh, Flanchlivlin hierarchy uh, for a lot of time, uh, but I'm not really interested in war with them, so we haven't done it. But apart from that, yeah, really just taking things over, building the occasional building. Uh, I haven't done all the upgrades. I could probably go and set a bunch of things to upgrade, but yeah, it's just letting the game run and chilling out. But yeah, anyway, war. Uh, where are where are our fleets? Oh, they're over here. Now it's gonna take them a while to get here, uh, like a very long time. Yeah, because it's 28 days in game, but it's a very long. Yeah. Oh, by the way, every vote is gonna fail in the uh, inside here because I'm voting no on everything. So yeah, they're just all gonna fail. Uh, but yeah, it's gonna take them a while to get here. So though it's not taking them very many days. Um, the problem is the game runs very slowly, as you can no doubt see, so uh, each day is a longer amount of time than you would expect. Right, should be moving over any time now though. How many troops do they have? Or um, They have 63,000 strength, okay. That doesn't really seem like enough. Oh, are these guys just sitting here going like, come on, if you think you're hard enough basically? I was trying to see. No, I, I don't have a huge defense th thing in there, so I don't know why they haven't moved forward. Anyway, all of our fleet should be arriving soon. Let me just have a look at the jumps uh, here. Yeah, I'm just going to pause it. There we are. Right. This fleet, um, in particular, let me just demark some. I'm going to use it to jump on top of the enemy. No, we'll jump both of these. There we go. Initiate jump here. Cool. So they will now just appear on top of the enemies. Uh, yeah, on top of the enemies ones there and we'll be fine. I just realized I'm missing something else. I'm also missing... Uh, where is it? Somewhere down here. Factions? No, no, okay. Clo let, let's just close these. Let's do it from the other way around. Let's close these. Sectors, shipyards, star bases, military fleets, civilian fleets. Is it in military fleets? Uh, no, oh, it's not anywhere because I need to get them off of Earth. Right. 
to actually sectors would probably be the easiest. Armies. Embark all. There we go. So now they should show up in military fleets. Maybe. There we go. I don't know where they show up on the site. I'll be honest. I've forgotten. Maybe it is in civilian? Which doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Nope, they're not there, because that would make no sense whatsoever. Um, Yeah, I don't know where they would be. Maybe they'll appear in a second. Under their own category or something. I don't know. Anyway, um, they are going to go here. Cool. How's the army that I dropped in over here, or the navy I dropped in over here doing? Not well. Engaging well. enemy fleet. Okay, oh, is that the enemy fleet I'm engaging? Hopefully it is. Let's have a look. Oh, it's the, uh, it's, it's the building. Okay. Incoming transmission. Oh, no. We bring alarming news, human friends. Contact with our colony on New Balderac has been lost. They no longer respond to any of our satellite transmissions, and we fear the worst. Perhaps the aliens who bombarded our original homeworld have returned to finish the job. Please send a ship to investigate. Sure. Long updated. I'll do that. New Balderac was somewhere over here, I think, but I could probably use the log. Uh, go to. Okay. Do I have a science ship anywhere nearby? Yeah, that one will do. Research. Cool. You're working your way over. Right. Um, you guys, you attacking? You are attacking. Cool. This seems like it's gonna go well. Hey, one of them's trying to run away. Spaceport under attack. Keep, keep going. Try and catch him. Which spaceport is under attack? Oh, our spaceport is under attack. I think. Okay. We're about to win this one. Um right. Spaceport lost. Whoa, what do you mean spaceport lost? Where did we lose it? Oh here? Wait, what? Oh, up here? These void spawn maybe? Maybe they are what attacked us? I don't know. Possibly. Could be. You would expect another pop up for that though. Right. Are we attacking? We are attacking. Good. You guys, uh, head here, then like, here? Yeah, something like that. Do that. How's this going? Looks like it's going pretty well. Lots of pretty lights going off. I believe the storm's nullifying, um, shields? Sublight, uh, speed reduction and shield nullification, yeah. Leader dead. Oh, uh, probably someone who's in charge of a fleet that I want to replace. Yeah, yeah. Uh, can't replace him right now. Okay. How about now? Wait two seconds. Okay. All right. Let's try and click on some other things. See if the UI will fix itself. There we go. Right. Pause. Sign leader. It's always better to do it while paused, because otherwise uh, you can't actually do it. Right. Cool. Uh, I'm going to send this 80,000 one over here. Uh, actually, over here. And I'm going to send the... Wait. Yeah, I'm going to send the 30,000 one over here. Send the 80,000 one over here. Cool. Let's go with that. Right. Uh, it's my army here yet. No. Technology discovered. I believe that this uh, shipyard probably shouldn't be traveling with us and should probably just be living in uh, Unith, I would guess. Right. Uh, new one here. Let's get more minerals from jobs. Right. Back down this way. These guys are splitting up. 
Um, must be a way of seeing your ships. It's not going to be in star bases. That's stupid. What's this? Oh, right. That's fine. We're we're attacking a transport fleet. Should be fine. I I would think. Yeah, hopefully. Uh, hmm. I have no idea. I, I'm sure you used to be able to see it. Nope, I have absolutely no idea. Oh well, whatever. Uh, isn't important as long as I know where they are. They are still working on it? Yeah, okay. Let's find another 30 days till they move. Right. They have built up another fleet here, which is a little bit worrying. Attack. Is that other fleet moving? Nope. Okay. You guys are all waking your way over here. May I suggest that you jump? There we go. Right, this one here is just purely here to kind of hold the situation. Oh, wham well, there. Yeah, let's just not click anything. You're currently attacking the station, that's fine. Alright. Hey, our armies are here. Nice. Fleets have arrived. All of them, your job is to attack this thing. Let's go. That should just be a destruction, I would imagine. Just trying to look where there's... Yeah, I think most of the places we need to take over are here. Near the Celestial Throne. The game does not like me zooming in on the most interesting war, unfortunately. Let's see. I love seeing all the lasers going off everywhere. Even if you only get to see them very uh, regularly. Oh, I'm just seeing if we zoom in you can see every shot coming in. Oh wow. Yeah, they are getting swarmed. That'll be the end of that then. Well, not quite yet. I'm actually surprised. That's That was uh, longer than I thought it would take. Um, right. Although I think it's because I zoomed in. That's probably why it took longer. Uh, yeah, buy some moats. I've been lowering the, pl uh, the price of moats for a while. So I could buy uh, so I could uh, buy them in bulk when they were cheaper. Didn't really work out that way, but hey, there you, there you have it. Right, we now control everything. You guys, four days. I'll just let you move in four days. That's fine. Now, where is their? Yeah, yeah. So I want you to land on that world. Is there a? Yeah, there is a garrison there, but I don't think it's going to survive us. I've been raising army uh, damage and health for the last, I don't know, 20, 30 years in game. This should uh, probably be fine. Sending them over and... Yeah, this is going to be a bit of destruction, I would imagine. Something like that. We're getting closer. I just want to see how this goes, because I'm imagining it's going to be quick, but it might just be disappointingly slow. Let's see. So they're all landing in the pods. Not quite there yet. Entering the Deploying atmosphere and... Forces. There we have it. We are significantly stronger. Um, I, we're also uh, absolutely full on apples, so let's sell all of our apples. And with that, I'm going to buy a single lot of rare crystals. Cool. Right, let's have a look at strength. So that's 7.8 to 15.75. Okay, so they're actually comparable in strength. We just have more. Like a lot more. Cool. Uh, I don't know how they got repaired, but that's fine. Guess maybe we took over a star base? Yeah, I think because we have eight here, they're just gonna fall over and die because we have 
just significant. Because not only are we more, doing more damage, but we have an extra, like, three that are going to be attacking them, so their health Technology just drop. discovered. Okay, let's see. Army damage. Oh, perfect. Uh, let's go for army health. Right. Yeah, so we've lost one, and none of theirs have yet retreated. Yeah. That seems about right. Colony they retreated, conquered. and we've now conquered the colony. Nice. Uh, Kerbal over here. Known for its uh, space program. Let's jump over there and have a look. Right. Invasion over. Ah, uh, all of ours can repair here. Oh, that's cool. So let me just have a look. So why... Oh, there's peace. Okay. Uh, they made peace with the Vran Unity. We have won this war. Nice. Um... Yeah, white peace without border adjustments. Fair enough. A return? Nearest allied starbase. No, I want you to return to Earth and land here. There we go. Right. And then all of these ships here under military ships. Not the Grand Reformer because it's already there. You're all going to return to home base. There we go. Right. Well, that is everything exciting that's going to happen for the next five years. That's okay. Uh, I imagine we have a truce with these guys now, so I don't think there's going to be anything too crazy happening. Uh, did anything happen from this? No, it's still going. It's got 36 days. We'll wait for that. Yeah. This could be the most exciting thing that's ever happened to us. So, it's time to go. They fear the worst for the colony. I mean, maybe this is the end times event and we're just uh, just now discovering it. The thing that wiped out their colony is actually a group of... Uh, yeah, it, it's a, just a group of cubes that arrived one day, wiped them out with their uh, nanotechnology and assimilated them. Seems unlikely given that the people are gas, but you know, you never know. Ten days left. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, three, two, one days. Special project complete. Our investigation of new uh, Baldurac revealed nothing out of the ordinary. The satellite the colony used to communicate with their capital is still functioning as far as we can tell. Greetings from the new Baldurac Revolutionary Front. We have thrown off the yoke of oppression and are at last free from the tyranny of Baldurac. We have no quarrel with you, human, as long as you refrain from aiding the Baldurac imperialists in their inevitable attempt to crush our revolution. You could help us take the fight to our enemies, however. Would you be willing to deliver one of our commander unit, uh, commando units to Baldurac? Um... No, this is an internal dispute and we don't get involved. Uh, tell us what you have planned. We want to infiltrate Baldrak with one of our elite commando units. They will then incite a popular uprising against the decadent elite that lords over our people. After the tyrants have been deposed, all Dathnak uh, will know what it is to have true freedom. A straightforward plan if ever there was one human. No, we are not getting involved in your internal dispute. Of course you're not. You wouldn't want the revolution to spread to the oppressed masses in your tyrannical empire. Can't have that. Wow. Okay. Well, no, I'm not going to send your commando unit because it breaks the uh, prime directive. So, that's what we're going to do. Um, I was just waiting to see if there was another event. Oh, what's, what's this? Oh, that's just the Antari Mercantile Union. Okay. <laughs> I was like, ooh, it's something new. Well, just Chantari Mercantile Union. I think they might have taken some land or they've always been there. One or the other. Oh yeah, what well, up here if this void spawn? Were we going to get rid of it? I don't know if we were going to get rid of it. I don't see any reason to. What's up with it? What's it doing? Just kind of hovering around? Okay. I mean, that's fine. It can hover. Yeah. No rules against hovering. Yeah, we'll just leave it be. Live and let live. 
Same with the uh, ones that are over here as well, the amoebas and whatever this, these unidentified aliens were with the extra wormholes. Yeah, sure, I'll extend our deal. It's something to spend money on. Right, unpause. Let it go. And anything else happening? Technology discovered. I speak on behalf of the lawful Dathnak government on Baldrak. We have received a manifesto from the group that seized control of New Baldrak, and boy what a bunch of hogwash. These brigands and anarchists are a terrible embarrassment to us human. Will you help us stomp out their little revolution before it spreads here and someone actually gets hurt? General uh, Paltanak has prepared an expeditionary force to retake the colony, but we will need your help transporting it there. You need to solve your own problems. You'll be sorry once this rebellion spreads to your planet, human. Don't think it won't. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure their rebellion's gonna spread to uh, my planets where I pay for everybody's everything all the time. Yeah, it, se it seems like the kind of place that's gonna rebel. Yeah. N a nice and comfy place, you know? N known for rebelling. Right, um, let's see. Upgrade fleet. Upgrade fleet, upgrade fleet, upgrade fleet, upgrade fleet, oh, upgrade fleet. I'm just feeling like this is the time to do it because they've just been out fighting. Got a few upgrades here, another upgrade. You're going to hear ship complete Technology a lot. Technology discovered. Maybe. Or I'm going to hear ship complete a lot. Um, energy credits. Cool. Right, close that down, and let it run a little bit more. How are our sectors looking? Eh, looking alright. Pretty much every sector is devoid of jobs to some degree. Don't entirely know why they're all devoid of jobs, but hey, they all are, and that's what matters. Um, right, so we're about a month out from the end of the year. Let's see if there's anything else that we need to do here. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I was down here-ish when I was doing my building. Yeah, yeah. You can see these ones are the ones I haven't got to yet. Actually, I've already done this one and it's got a new building available. So this is actually untrue when I said I hadn't got to it yet. Right. Uh, I think I'd got down like here-ish. Yeah, this looks more like where I was. Right, and basically it's just a matter of uh, build some luxury residences. Upgrade a few buildings and then uh, set them on their way. Right. Oh, we're, we're full on alloys despite having just uh, set a bunch of things to upgrade. Okay. Get rid of the alloys. The alloys, we're then going to buy one of those and one of those. Cool. Puts us back around uh, 40,000 to each of them. And we have just passed the year end. So I feel like this is a good point to end the episode. Thank you for watching. Uh, we did six years in that episode. We've got seven years left until something might happen, maybe. If it doesn't happen then, it'll happen like 25 years after that or 50 years after that. And yeah, we'll see. Hopefully in seven years, we will get an event. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.